know, every business that I walk into, I, I see the same things. I see people in pain. I see people frustrated. I see people not able to articulate what exactly is going on in the organization, but they know that something needs to change. They know it's not ideal. But they feel like their hands are tied and they really, honestly, don't have the answers. Everyone thinks, oh, you know, something's gonna change in the economy and everything's gonna break wide open and lead back to how it was where we had tons of business, so much business we didn't know what to do with and everybody was busy and we were hiring people and they weren't very productive but we were just hiring more people because we could afford to hire more people. So ever since I entered the workforce, I've seen the same problems crop up again and again. I've seen the same issues. And when I was younger, I won't tell you how old I am, but over 20 years ago, when I entered the workforce and I, and I saw these problems, I thought, well, someone's gonna recognize them and someone's gonna do something about them. And I was shocked that nobody ever did. I always wondered about this because I thought, you know, if I just switch companies, if I just change jobs, then everything would change. It, it would all be different. And guess what? It's not. You have got hidden talent within your organization that is underutilized, that is unengaged, that is failing. And guess what? They're failing themselves as well. Good enough is not good enough. The fact is that we've got to bring our A game. We've all got to be honest with each other. We've got to communicate more effectively. So there's really, there's four stages of failure. I think we're all guilty of number one. And that is the failure to anticipate a problem before it arrives. Okay, but stage two is what I'm talking about. And that is the failure to recognize a problem when it does arrive. Then you slip into stage three, where you fail to act when you recognize the problem. It's a dangerous, slippery slope to stage number four, which is total failure when it becomes too late to actually do anything about it. And this, this may be true in, in somebody's career. This may be true in a particular position. This may be true for an entire company. Mediocrity is not good enough anymore. It's time to get thrival. If not now, when? Stage three, stage four, 